Hello buddy, my name's the Farman and welcome to uh, Farming Simulator 2017 on the British Stars map. Um, yes, so I am going to start to, uh, doing videos again. Um, quick couple of things I wanted to just uh, get like sorted. Um, one, I didn't want to play on the original maps because they are just shit. I do hate them. Sorry for the language, but I just do not like them at all. Um, so that's kind of why that just abruptly halt, that abruptly stopped. So this was a British map release. There are a couple coming out now, which are pretty good. Um, unfortunately, in this map, you do own all the fields to start with. So I've just changed them all to false, apart from fields uh, six, five, thirteen, and two, which is that big grass field over there. Um, we've got barley, canola, and canola. The reason I've done it like that is because there's no crops actually in the ground when you start the game, so I've had to uh, kind of, well, I've put them in with the tractors and machinery. Um, there's a cat somewhere. Let me pet it. Pet, 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 pet. Right, okay, so I'll just quickly walk you through. So we've got the New Holland uh, TC590. This is what you start with as a combine. You've also got a small little tether. We're going to get rid of this big side mower here. Um, because we've got a loading wagon so we can do a few other bits you get a, a slurry spreader there you do get a little single windrow uh, turner you get a T5 with a well you don't actually get this trailer you get a different one I think I've had to sort of make a few changes you've also got what, a Mass Ferguson 5813 with the Pottinger well the Euro Boss sorry uh, Thing. Now the reason this is here is because you do start off with the case uh, IH1555 I think it is or 45 whatever and I didn't want that so I've bought this and I've also bought an 8340 here New Holland uh, what does that replace oh the Deutz you start with the Deutz as well um, got rid of the plow got a small cultivator seeder and sprayer manure spreader there and that's about it we are going to be changing a lot of this equipment. We will get rid of that loading wagon at some point, but for doing silage at this moment in time, it seems a good choice. So we're going to go over to the field. As you, as you can see, this the uh, uh, who is it? David Oldfield has released the what's it called? Seasons mod for this. He's released it for this map. Well, no, this game, sorry, sorry. This the FS seventeen. That's probably not that's probably just hit the post, but you know. So we'll kind of just pull over here a bit with the header trailer. Leave it there. Now we are using the G twenty seven. Oh I can't actually see where the header trailer is. I know my luck, I probably just put it the wrong bloody way round. Yes, that's my luck, isn't it? To be the wrong way round. Um oh, I don't want to drive on that. The reason there's barley in here is just because Well, I don't actually know. <laughs> I did just put it in there. I, I I'm hoping to try and start cows fairly early on, or animals at least. Um, but I'm not too sure because we are playing on hard difficulty and because the way Giants has done the economy in this game, it is absolutely impossible to really get going. I think we'll harvest the barley first. We're going to have to do a bit of harvesting because the way that the... Some of these... Alright, we'll, we'll come out and say Some of these maps are half finished, shall we say. Uh, you know, so... So this one, this one's okay. I'm actually quite happy with this one. And the reason I say some of the maps are half finished means that some some of the hired workers won't actually help. Um, they just keep stopping in the middle of fields because they think the collisions are, you know, too close. So we're just going to do this a lot of harvesting. Um, I do want to get a lot of videos done tonight. A lot of videos, well, just sort of one after each other. Mm. 
course you've got the what's it's now now the pits are under covers as well they've got the what's it's on sheds um, so yeah we're gonna be making a bit of money we might even do a bit of logging in a few videos but we are gonna attempt to do the pigs as well because they're quite easy to do they're only behind field 10 or 11 um, so I would like to get them started they're probably the cheapest to really start off with I think I'm not too sure but I think they are the cheapest to really get you know just started with probably doing this wrong by you know not picking the header the header up but you know so yeah that's why there's been no videos and also it got a bit hectic at work you know I was like literally everywhere and anywhere so but now we've it's all calmed down we're on winter hours now so it's you know I get home a bit late a bit earlier but yeah I just didn't want to put the standard maps out why are all the eggs floating there that's what I mean by half finished all the eggs are here from the chickens so we'll uh, have to get them from there we won't be playing this map too much in the way of once something better comes out we will go on to that but this is a map to do for now and we will get a bit of a, a pretty good series out of it because it was actually one of the very first series I actually did for FS15 I think it was yeah so. and we did about 10 episodes on that and then I found another map to do And there it, it, there's a multiplayer game in the pipeline like I keep saying uh, Nick's actually got a server which we're going to I'll put all the links in the description um, they may ha you might they might not come out the, the, the exact day this video comes out because Nick is actually away at this of recording this video and um So I would like to, you know, because then I, I can't, I don't know where the, where anything is and what he wants me to put. So I don't want to do it, do it and then he not have it, if you know what I mean. Um, <clears throat> yes. So anyway, how is everyone doing? I'm doing good. Um, so videos will come back up. We should hopefully get start having them up, back up and running as normal. But like I said, I just didn't want to play the standard maps. They were. I just don't enjoy. <coughs> sorry. I just don't enjoy just standard stuff. Um, they're all right just to get hold of the game and you know just see what happens. But for anything else, they were just. Boring. I just did not enjoy them at all. So I, I kind of just went. I just kind of waited till some maps come out. There are some maps coming out. Um, Nick has already actually made a map, and it all went a bit pear shaped, <laughs> which was quite funny. But no, it would have really, it would have really made me just not want to make a map. So. But we're gonna just attempt to just turn on this one. What? That's probably wrong, but I'm not too bothered. Now, of course, we do not have a um, baler to pick up any of these up, but and there's no point putting them into the cows because there's no cows here or anything like that because we don't own anything. So we are just going to cultivate in. We do need a plow though. We will have to get a plow because I do like I do like just letting hired workers plough and stuff like that. Um, yeah, one thing I might do is get the pits done, you know, for, for when we do get the cows, so that they're uh, at least... So there's at least something for them to eat once we get them. We can at least tip a bit in. Right, this thing is on 80%, so we're going to need to... Uh, we're going to need to get the trailer over here in a minute. Right, so let's just kind of go over here. 
You know, we're going to attempt to try and pick the like, kind of middle one. Which is not going to be too easy, and I am just randomly guessing where the middle one is. Sort of, sh sort of straight down the middle of the field, but it's not straight, is it really? But oh well. See, I have been wanting to get this video done for quite a bit. Oh, I've just been on the multiplayer game with Nick and all them lot. Um, so, yeah. We will be uh, getting a few tractors. I've got a few modded tractors that are uh, available to be downloaded as well. And I would like to have them in this, this Let's Play. They would make a great addition. Well, yeah, they would make a great addition to the farm. There's a John, couple of John Deere's and a few other bits. Oh, you bastard. I honestly did not see that that was getting full. Right, so we'll just leave that there. Tab, so that's the Ford New Orleans. Right. T5. T5 is a tractor I haven't really used a hell of a lot. Um, it's good on this map because it's small and it's quite nimble, so it does go around corners a lot easier. So let's cut in here. But yeah, I uh, I am pretty sorry, guys, about the videos and stuff like that. It is. I just didn't want to upload stuff that I was not enjoying. And I like this map. I mean, it it is a good map. I mean, it may have a few bugs, but what can you do? Um, oh, go a bit far forward. Right, I think we'll collect the eggs whilst we're here. Well, this is a bit easy because you just walk in a straight line and just kind of... They're at eye level, so you can just kind of just pick them up. Well, some of them are at eye level. These are the ones that are going to be buggers. Yeah, like that one and that one there. I just can't reach them, so that'll have to do. Right, is. New Holland is this trailer is nearly full already. So sorry, it's, it's yeah. Well, I keep saying sorry, but you know, sorry, it's just going to be a harvesting video. But I kind of wanted to get this on video to show that I hadn't just cheated in money, which I haven't actually done. I managed to actually afford the eight three forty and the that massive Ferguson just by selling the two other tractors that were here and the plow and one or two other things. but we will be getting rid of everything that is here and just changing it to something else because I do like to just use mods and nice stuff that I like because I do like that Massey and what's it and it probably, oh not B it probably would have been better to make that little Massey Ferguson the uh, what's it, the loader tractor but you know that little Massey is now actually the most powerful tractor we have in that farm. It's 130 horsepower, and the New Holland 8340 is only 125, and I don't know what the T5 is. Which is uh, pretty good, because that means that thing can go out and do the... Well, we can't really do too much groundwork with it, because it isn't very heavy, and we don't have a weight at this moment in time. And I've also put this uh, New Orleans in a bit of a strange place. Sorry, I know cutting through the trees is not is not realistic or anything, but you know I'm not going to get out just to move that. We just go around it. And I do, uh, <laughs> I do like it. So yeah, there'll be some video. There'll be a lot of videos coming out. Hopefully, I'm going to start 
getting back to a normal schedule of not shit. Um, and most of the time the reason they stop is because I just don't have either I don't have the time to put into the game at that moment in like the week or so. These three weeks have been like the busiest three weeks ever. Of oh, well, I could have probably played, you know, less on the server and actually made videos or made videos on the server and done it that way, but you know, still. So uh, we'll be we'll be getting cracking on with this. Um, this is of course not the uh, standard map, so this should either this should be easier to get money on, or it'll be a lot better to watch because I'm I like this map. I like British small British farms. You know I don't I don't enjoy big fucking American farms like Gold Valley and well they're not American are they? Are they got are they American? I think Gold Valley is Sof Soznovka is Russian. I know that. And, you know, that's just something that I just... It just doesn't interest me. Big, big American maps. They just don't... It's just not... It's just not what I like, you know. Let's get the pipe out. Oh. We might as well just quickly fill this trailer up whilst we've still got some room. fill this up and then I think you can store it at our farm because I'm not too sure what the prices are yet so we'll have a, just a quick oh uh, so we've got eggs in backpack 18 we don't want to know that there's a loan of a hundred thousand of course we've had everything for four days that's how long the growth cycles take is four days so I need to remember that uh, so barley is so sunflower and soybean are money makers um, well and so is canola so we need to try and get into these three so but yeah it's it's not it's not anywhere at the moment in time so I might just store it for now and then put it in later because we are going to need the money but we're not going to need it we are going to need the money for seeds shall I say and not now um, oh, no. if that makes any sense to anyone so we're going to need it for when we're seeding so we'll be able to just sell it off so we'll be able to just do the cultivating and that with the money we've got and then we'll crack on seeding and spraying with uh, with it and, and, that. and I'm, I'm going to try and make my videos a little bit better um, personally I do think they're okay but I there's a couple of things here and there I want to just fix. Um, I want to make a better outro. I mean, the Kier the one that Kieran's made is pretty is good, but you know I do want to just upgrade it a bit because it is just a black screen with some writing on, and I would like to have one with a, either some music or links to Facebook and you know Twitter and places like that, or you know just links so you could either talk to me and whatever. Or um, and a bit and to go to the next video in the series or the previous video and stuff like that. But I might not bother with a intro. And I want to make my thumbnails better because my thumbnails are pretty atrocious at this moment in time. They are not the best. And uh, I would like to make. I would like them. To, I just. I just like my videos to appeal, like appear a bit better. Um, because you know. But anyway, um, enough about uh, blabbering on about that. So, first thing on the agenda of uh, this map that we're going to try and get into. I want to start the either cows. Yeah, I want to start the cows a bit earlier on. Because if you can get them going and have at least something for them to eat, they will make a lot of money quick if that makes any sense and it's not like we need a load of tractor there because we've already got one we just haven't got the load of brackets no we've got the brackets I mean the loader itself um, so we will probably just you know have a quick probably just try and find one quickly and then 
set it up. Now we're going to cut this sort of small square up here and then we're going to cut the other square. And we're going to get this bit over here we missed. Well, that I missed because I'm bad. But I'm liking the way I'm doing this video with, you know, a lot of it in cab and not too much of it out of cab. Um, makes it feel a bit more, you know, as if you're actually in the game. Um, Uh, I'm also in my new room, so that means I'm going to get the face cam thing sorted out so it's permanently up, um, and I will make sure I look okay-ish when I go on face cam and not like a bag of shit. Um, and have the screen and all that behind me like I had downstairs, but have a proper proper one that's all permanently put up. Because I, because this, cause my computer setup is in a corner, it's kind of, you know, I can have one permanently set up. And if you're wondering why every time it's, it kind of looks like the game's freezing a bit, I have auto save on. Because the amount of times I've forgotten to save and it's crashed, or I've done something stupid and it's crashed. So, auto save, well, auto save the game every, I think it's five minutes it does it. So it does it about four, four or five times every time I record a video. Because, of course, I make 20 minute videos. I'm, I'm, this is a 21 minute video. Um, I'm going to finish this little section here and then we'll uh, end the video. And it's not too bad of a yield off this crop. It could be better. I could make it better, but I just... The new the new yield thing in this game is completely above my head. I have no idea. Um, so what I'm going to do from now on is only spray the field. I think I'm going to spray the field on their first growth stage and then... Or, or maybe their second to last one or maybe even just spray it I did I sprayed this one on the last on the on this growth stage where it had grown so I might just do it like that because that seems to just be easier uh, you know I don't want to be f fucking about with these things so yeah I will uh, episode two we might just be fin we might be just harvesting another field I'm, I'm sorry, but that's just the way it goes. We will do a lot more of this in-cab stuff, and we might have the face cam all set up. Um, probably will, actually, and I'll have some lights to make it look a bit better. And you know, I will. I am now going to start taking care of my videos since uh, since it seems a bit unfair that everyone's been not having videos lately. But anyway, I'm going to leave this episode here. Thank you. I'm going to just turn the combine off so you can hear me. So thank you everybody so much for watching, leave a like down below if you enjoyed, subscribe more today and I shall see all of you in the next video. Oh and quickly, um, there will be a couple more links down in the description to, I think it's Shawnee B's channel and someone else's, I cannot remember the name of the other person, I'm really sorry but they do, they do uh, amazing uh, gameplay and stuff, they all do farm sim gameplay I think. Well, I know one of them does. I can't remember if Shawnee B does, but I know what he. I know he's got good content. Um, so they'll be linked down in the description. So go check them out. Give them a subscription. Well, give, subscribe to them and you know be friendly to them. And uh, anyway, but yes, thanks for watching and goodbye.